be educated, but I'm so frustrated. Hello to my loneliness. I guess that ignorance is bliss. Take me back to be born anew. Rewind, take it out of cue. Innocence can be a young man's game. Stand up for the heart of shame. I wish I knew. We got home just in time before the storm hit. I'm currently working out, me and my daughter. Um, the wind is like pretty, pretty strong out here. Nala keeps getting scared because it keeps thundering pretty bad. But um, the rain has definitely gone down a little bit. Earlier it was really, really bad. But we got home just in time before the rain. But um, I'm gonna continue and work out and I'll probably talk to you guys on another day. Wow, look at those trees. Don't mind the music in the background, it's my workout music. <laughs> This is the second time I try to film this. I was going to film me going to the shop so I could take you into the shop so you could see, but my car has to get fixed again. If you've seen my last vlogs, you know when I first started vlogging again and started my YouTube channel all over again, my car had broken down and that was very frustrating. I didn't have a car for like almost a week because I had my thermostat broke. And then from, from that breaking down, it messed up my engine for the fans. And then my um, hose was leaking from the radiator. So all of that, it was just like a little chain 
broke everything which made me spend so much money on stuff that i was not planning and on that video i said you know you purchase a brand new car because you don't plan on spending on parts so if you're sp you're planning on getting a jeep just know it, it jeep does stand just empty every pocket because they ain't lying they are not lying i was so frustrated right now while i was getting there i was like if it's these calipers again that i just put on because they messed up they were messed up i've actually changed all four calipers on this car which i had told the dealership before about the car that something was wrong with the calipers and because i'm a female of course i don't think they took me seriously but no i was right see some of us know about cars because we like cars <sighs> anyways i'm just so frustrated right now <laughs> because i just called somebody else and they have they're gonna try to get me in tomorrow but just the fact that it's just one thing after another is crazy this is not the way to start the new year <sighs> but i need to relax we said we were gonna relax i'm trying to relax i'm just trying not to be frustrated because i was like i i just finished paying what i paid off last time from all of that break, breaking down on the front and now this too i don't know how much this is gonna be luckily the place is close to my daughter's high school so after i drop them off tomorrow i can just leave her there because they said it's not recommended to drive the car so long with this issue so yeah i think i'm just i'm just over it <laughs> i kept telling my husband yesterday i'm like this close to buying a new car but i don't have the money and i don't want to pay the interest rates at the money at the money at the moment it's just uh it's frustrating it's just frustrating because no and then see the reason i wouldn't get a new car either because then your payments go up again like you're so close to finishing and they just boop, goes back up and it's just like no and the interest rates being right now at eight percent no no thank you uh -uh. i'll just wait how long i wait i'll know i don't know <laughs> but anyways not what i was planning to vlog for you guys but definitely this is part of my channel you know this is why i called it un dia a la vez one day at a time because you have to take days one at a time and then these are the things that happen to all of us every day unexpected things like this this is so funny it's just so funny because i was just thinking like like oh yay i paid this off i got this good we're good and then there's you know those intrusive thoughts she came in and she was like well, as long as your car don't break down You manifested it into it ellie see this is what you get stop stop <laughs> manifestation is real don't 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 put it out there your car is going to be fixed and then nothing else is going to break down that's what we're going to manifest from now on because she's doing good nothing's wrong she's doing good <laughs> i swear oh my goodness so now i'm going to take my husband's car i'm going to go pick up the girls um and yeah that's about it uh, I think the last thing I vlogged before my rant was you got to see a sneak peek of the items for my daughter's room. They have come in and things are starting to look so cute. I'm so excited. She's so excited because she's looking at everything and I tell her, if you don't like it, let me know so I can send it back so we can order something else. So everything's here on time. So that's what I'm doing now. But um, so far, everything's coming on so quick. I was very surprised. I was like, wow, things are getting here really, really quick. But um my next video is definitely not going to be about that. I think it's going to be, I don't know, interesting. And my my second video that I put every two weeks is going to be a little interesting. So I can't wait for that one too. But yeah, let me start talking. I mean, let me stop talking. I got to go pick up the girls because then it's going to get late. And I just, yeah, not, not in it. I'm kind of thinking of going to Goodwill. I'm, I'm kind of because I'm actually a little earlier than what I thought. I might go to Goodwill and just to see what they have. Just to like not shop but it's i like to take go look at look at things i'm just that way i don't know just to like <sighs> relax and depress this the the what do you call it the de decom no compress decompose yeah something my brain's all over the place okay guys i'll talk to you guys later when i'm in a better mood
Hey everybody, so we're in my husband's car. I apologize for the crookedness and that you can barely see me half partial. Um, it's very hard to try to film in his car because there's not really a lot of spaces where I can um, put you up on and we're on my phone. Every time I'm in my car, I am filming on my phone because it's easier than putting my big old camera somewhere because it will fall off. So I'd rather film on my phone. But anyway, so you guys know what time it is. I'm in the car. I was just at Goodwill and I found two things that I actually needed, which was kind of funny because one thing I was just talking about it with my daughter this morning. She is in student government. So they do a lot of like baking and stuff to sell, to do fundraisers and raise money for the school. So one thing she needs to do is bake cupcakes. So I found this thing right here that you, it's already like pre-cut and whatever. And it would be like, you know, perfect sizing for the um i said cupcakes brownies i mean brownies <laughs> brownies but um we were just talking about this daughter we need to make some brownies so you can bring them in so you can do you know do your share of selling them so that was really really funny that i actually found this it was only 5.99 i really don't know how much they sell it at the store but it's non-stick it comes with three pieces like it shows right there and i thought that was perfect so it was kind of funny because we were just talking about it this morning and then since I've been doing my daughter's nails at home, uh, I needed something where I could soak her nails in. And I have a glass bowl that used to be, I'm trying to think, it used to be a vase, vase, somewhere in the house. I told her, just grab that for now. But it was so funny because I found this right here. Can you see guys? Okay. It like goes away. Yeah, it's a nail salon bowl kit and it's still in the box and I thought it was so cute um, because I had this but my daughter put something in it and it melted. <laughs> it melted them all. So you get two of these inside and I thought that was cute. cute. You can't see it but it has where you can put each of your fingers in its own little compartment to soak off your nails and I thought that was awesome because we need them because you know you get one for each hand instead of having just one because i only had one of these and now in the box you actually get you can see two of them so i thought that was so cool and that was only how much was this 3.99 so that was not bad i spent like a total of ten dollars for both of these things and both of these things are things i needed but yep you guys know where i'm at i am waiting for my little ones to get out of school and then after this i think i'm going to um get them something to eat from I don't know where probably taco bell i don't know taco bell or i might get him some pizza today i don't know um yeah my daughter's been doing the boycott thing and so um um starbucks mcdonald's kentucky fried chicken kfc i mean talk no not taco bell what else Oh no, maybe Taco Bell too. Well, there's a, quite a few places that, you know, because of the strike, we no longer, you know, go out to eat to those places. And um, it's okay. If that is what my daughter feels, you know, very strongly about, I support her in that. And um, I knew about Starbucks at first. Uh, when I found out about Starbucks, I was just about to tell her when she told me, like we just boom at the same time told each other. And we both have decided on, you know, boycotting Starbucks. And then from there, she found out about the list and she read out the list and she said, mom, like these are the places I no longer want to eat at. And for my daughter to be like, I don't want to go to McDonald's. That is a big thing because anybody who knows my daughter knows that she would die for her uh, chicken nuggets and she was like no i don't think that's correct i don't think that's right and so i will support her and this is what now what we do so there's limited uh, places out that we go now here in our um hometown especially we we're, we're preferring to go to our local places which is even better because we get to support you know our local community which is awesome um so yeah we prefer to do that now and i tried to go to more of the coffee shops around here too dunkin donuts is um one i don't think they're on the list from what i know of so we've been going to dunkin donuts or our local coffee shops but yep that's about it i will talk to you guys a little bit later um i think they're almost out of school almost i always think like i'm late and then i'm like too early i don't know i never like make it just on time <laughs> but it's okay but um yeah i haven't haven't done much this week it's been pretty pretty chill i do need to organize some things in my diy closet i might do that this week because i was planning on um cleaning my car i i still might do that because she, she's not gonna be seen until monday 
I want her to go in clean and not all dirty because I was looking at her today. I was like, girl, you have crumbs all over the place. I need to get this clean. This is not like you. So I might do both things. It depends. It's been saying it's going to rain. So that's why I wasn't sure if I was going to be able to do my car or not. But definitely I need to get that um, that uh, DIY closet cleaned up because it's after Christmas and all of that. Things have just been shoved in there and I need to organize and make sure all of that is good. But yes, I will talk to you guys probably tomorrow or saturday i don't know we'll see i never know i just pick up the camera nowadays and just start talking to it randomly so i don't know i feel like that's better than just trying to like constantly be like on monday on tuesday you know yeah but okay guys see y'all later bye